Hello everyone, this is Matt Hoots with Rated Green, and I ran into a friend, one of the Rated Green members at the International Builder Show in 2022. We've got Dr. John McKeon here, and we happen to be next to one of the products that they actually certified. Uh, they did allergy testing for LG, and he's gonna explain a little bit about the, their process, what they do, and what their brands, their, their, their signature, their certification means on this actual product. Great to bump into you again here, Matt, and or the International Builder Show. 2022 in Orlando and yes you've, you've managed to find us in the LG booth and LG is a really interesting story because they've been in the certification program for a number of years they're one of our earliest clients and they've really embraced the concept of a healthy home and they've got a number of products all contributing to optimizing the indoor environment for health and wellness so you'll see here they have their clothes styler sometimes people say well how can a clothes styler be relevant to indoor air quality well obviously this will treat textiles for the buildup of bio burden and allergens and you can see the certification mark here right on the door and also over my right shoulder here then you'll see their laundry so again, you say, well, how is laundry connected to a healthy home? Well, when we think about dust mite allergen in our bedding and, and other pollens that we bring in from the outdoor environment. So even though we may have a home that's been designed and then constructed as a healthy home, we need to consider how we live in that home on an ongoing basis and the levels of allergens and pollutants that can build up in that home over time. So LG then will also have uh, vacuum cleaners, both the robotic vacuum cleaners, as well as air cleaners as well. So it's very much that whole, whole of house approach, how we live and how we can focus on having the optimum indoor environment for health and wellness. So on these particular products right here, like what kind of tests do you do on these products? So for the laundry, we were looking at removal of allergens. So what's the temperature that the uh, laundry can get up to? Certain proteins get denatured at various temperatures. Are we uh, washing them and laundering them sufficiently to remove those allergens so they don't build back up over time? And then when you're considering products like tumble dryers, you want to make sure that you are drying your clothes thoroughly so you're not allowing any buildup of, of mold which could happen with residual moisture. And then very much for the styler, a similar thing, we're looking at uh, removing allergens. You may have delicate items, you may have children's toys that you don't want to put in a full laundry, but you want to make sure they get steamed and we denature and remove allergens, surface allergens. And then for vacuum cleaners, uh, again, it may be a surface, but really we maintain our surfaces so we optimize the air in the breathing zone. So we're looking at the vacuum cleaner's ability to pick up allergens, but also to store them and lock them away, not to recirculate them into the indoor environment. And very much similar again with a robotic vacuum cleaner, which sometimes can be even better because you're not in the room while the vacuuming is taking place. Now, we're Rated Green and you, we have some Rated Green members that also work with allergy standards. For those that don't work with you, what's the best way to get in touch with you? Well, easiest go to our website, allergystandards.com. That's from a, from a B2B perspective, a lot of technical research papers, white papers, and there's obviously a form you can fill out and we'll get right back in touch with you. If there's consumers or maybe the people that your members sell to, uh, the website is asthmaandallergyfriendly.com. And that is all the information around certified products, how they're being tested, um, and where you can find them online. I appreciate your time. It was good running to you at the show. Likewise, always a pleasure, Matt. Hope to see you soon, and let's do one another webinar pretty shortly. Absolutely. Thanks.